you first heard this concept, let's have a rally to restore sanity, you thought what? Well, it's really the same concept as the way the whole show works. So that you start with an idea for something, be mm -hmm. it a joke or a story that you want to look at, and then we all work and play around with it together mm -hmm. and see what its limitations are and what point of views are interesting in it. So it was just another project, really. A project like a show that we do four times a week, or the book we just wrote, or this rally. It's really applying the same model of the way that we work together to a different idea. But a rally to restore sanity, it's perfect. We're going to be in Washington. It's the place to send up ins is, insanity. It is the least reasonable place on earth. Yeah, absolutely. Even when we were bussing these people in, you know, they have these kind of ideological views about how human yeah. discourse should be achieved. And we're driving them into the beltway and thinking, well, I wonder how long these, you know, so mm -hmm. many people have crossed that beltway. Right. with those ideals in their mind and then have ended up at cocktail parties shouting at each other. Uh, we knew that there were people starting to say that they were going and making plans, so we went out to look for people of differ, uh, differing views uh, and then brought them together and tortured them for three days and, <laughs> and basically yeah. shouted at them, threw things at them and hoping to demonstrate how reasonable they were. And, and when you found them, were, mm -hmm. you, were you looking for people who, uh, who were not flamethrowers? No, mean, we were looking for people that we could pigeonhole. So we were looking for people that we could try and manipulate, as the media <laughs> does, no offense, uh, as the, 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 uh, the media does to, uh, uh, to put them into boxes of this is, well, this is the rabid conservative, this is the angry Joe the pizza guy, uh -huh. these are the uh, socialists. Uh, and got so your we beauty queen, exactly. The, the your Muslim your couple, your beauty queen. That's right. You're Muslim. Yes. I mean, that's you know, that's you don't even need to describe him any further than that if you just want to deal in fear. So, uh, so yeah, we we wanted to pick people that were totally against being put into boxes and labelled and label them. Precisely so you could. That's right, so we could treat them exactly the way they did not want to be treated. The, all of these folks know you're coming with cameras. And yeah. so they're in on, the, and they know you're, you're the Daily Show, so yeah. they're in on the joke to that extent. They know, they know. Extent. And so they're, you know, like when we're on the bus, like for mm -hmm. the first three hours they're excited, then they were next two hours confused, then <laughs> angry, then tired, then maybe excited again. You know, it's, it's strange, they have to, we shot for a long time, mm -hmm. so we knew what we wanted, the kind of moments that we wanted, uh, and so they just had to trust us, really. When or not, they don't have, to, don't have to trust us, they just have to do it. They'd already agreed they were going to do it, so... I guess rather than having them say their point of view, you want to show their point of view. You want to see them behaving reasonably in the face of extreme media provocation, which we will provide. Happily so. Happily. Well, yeah. Yeah, happily so. Happily so. Yeah. So at the end.